Okay, welcome back. And uh, what we're going to do today is we're going to save um, our rectangle drawing. Uh, this is Chris Dennis, and this tutorial is about saving a drawing in AutoCAD. All right, so where we left off is we've got um, our rectangle drawing. We added some linear dimensions and we added some multi line text. And I think it's time now that we actually save this drawing into a folder so that um, so that we have a saved file of it. All right, so the easiest way to actually save a drawing in AutoCAD is you can actually come up to the application menu up here, which is the big red A, and click on that. And um, we're going to actually want to give this drawing a new name. So we're going to pick Save As and it cascades out into this menu um, and what we want to save it as is an AutoCAD drawing which is at the very top. So let's pick that and this brings us to a dialog box and most likely um, if your dialog box will bring you to my documents. Um, so I'm going to actually go up one level to my documents right here and before we actually just save the drawing in my documents, what I want to do is save it into my own folder um, for my drawing. So up here in the dialog box, uh, there's this handy little icon. It looks like a folder with a bright star in the corner. And if you click on that, what that does is it creates a new folder. So you can see down here we actually have a folder that says New Folder. So now I actually want to give that folder a name, so I'm going to right click on that and pick Rename. And when I do that, the name highlights and it's ready for me to type in a new name. So I'm going to call this um, My AutoCAD Drawings. And I'm actually going to double click on the folder so that now as you can see it's at the top of the screen and that means I'm in my folder so any drawings I save at this point will land inside of that folder. So down here where it says file name this is where I can give the drawing a name so I'm just gonna click in that box and it highlights the drawing name so that I can now type in um, I'm gonna call this rectangle drawing and if you notice underneath that, um, the type of file it, it's going to be is a DWG. It will automatically give it a DWG file extension. And that file extension is recognized by AutoCAD as a drawing file. So let's pick Save here. All right. And now if we look up at the top of um, the AutoCAD screen, at the very top, you can see now that it's changed from saying drawing one to the full path name with rectangle drawing dot DWG. So that is the new name of this drawing. Okay. So while I'm working along um, and making any changes to this drawing, um, I can quickly save it without having to um, go to the dialog box each time. So if you're working along and you want to just do a quick save, um, probably the fastest way is up here on the quick access toolbar. There is um, something that looks like a little disk and it's just a regular save. So now if I click that, um, you'll notice down here on the command line it executed QSave which is quick save. And that's a good habit to get into. Um, every half hour or so while you're working on a drawing just do a quick save and it keeps saving it back to rectangledrawing.dwg. I hope that helps you with uh, saving a drawing in AutoCAD and being able to locate where it is after you've saved it.